Fast forward, I got called and it's down to me and one other artist. Right. And his name is Lakeith Stanfield. For Dre. For Dre. Got so it. So we're sitting like this. We're both kind of, un- we're both really unknown. <laughs> He's like, I, he had ended up doing Atlanta after that, but right. we're both sitting like this. I'm looking at it and I'm competitive. So it was just like, Wait, what's up, bro? What's up, bro? So he's like this, I'm like this. And we knew what it was. So yeah. it was just like, yeah, go, you know, good luck. But I ain't yeah. mean it. I ain't mean it. You know, right. I, keep, I ain't mean it. Right. So boom, go in, get the job. Mm-hmm. Move to New York. Now mm-hmm. you're thrown into this wilderness where it's figure it out. Right. During that time. So the blessing has happened. You got yeah. the job. You're yeah. in New York. Yeah. You're thrown into the season two of this show that's catching real fire, right? Yeah. So there's mass attention. Yeah. There's mass money. Yeah. There's mass female attention too. Yeah. Yeah. And then there's this new work environment yeah. that you have to literally, obviously you're an incredible mm. actor, yeah. but what's day one like? Walking in on scene, you these the, the, the team, the crew kind of knows each other already because yeah. they've done a season. Right. You're walking into season two as the new guy. What's that like? Um... Not really knowing my place. You know, mm-hmm. I remember with Amari, you know, who plays Ghost, I said, the first thing I said to him was, yo, I want to learn from you, bro. Like, you know, and I'm here, to, you know, I'm here to be a sponge. And just like Ghost, for real, <laughs> like he said it while he was walking into the elevator and he sits on, like, stands. So I'm outside the elevator. I'm like, I just want to learn from you, man. You just let me know. And then he says something like, yeah, yeah like, you know, we're going to catch up or something like something like catch up then you have to catch up and it was like Vroom. and i was like oh yeah i was like oh this was like and again i was like all right so dramatic it was so dramatic but then i knew that oh everybody's about business mm. and again as a competitor i'm like oh my first instinct was oh that's how it's gonna be i bet like every other every scene that we are in every scene i'm winning with anybody i'm trying to body you right and that's how it has to be. It's like it's like a team, you know. Everybody loves each other, right? But at the same time, it comes down to like, yo, like this is how I feed myself. This is how I feed my family. So I'm gonna bring my A game. You gotta catch up, and right. that's what I took from that. Mm. Catch up, mm-hmm. 